there viewers, this is me, your host Dauntless, coming back at you again with some more Tactical European League Season 6 action. This time we have Italy and Romania going to war. So, let's get into it. But, before we go into it, please feel free to like the video, maybe subscribe to the channel, and if you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment down below. So, let's go, let's go. Alright, here we go. Italy and Romania on that cargo ship. Romania are the blue team, Italy are the orange team. A little bit of lag, first few seconds of the game, but you can see the bag has not quite spawned yet. As you see, uh, one of the Romanian players, sorry I won't be able to pronounce the name, I'm just going to call him Or. I believe that's the name of that squad. Using his loy operator, but the Bag is free in the center of the area. You got Zulu going in, taken out, and Gok gets the bag. Using that Zloy operator, Fry's throwing that uh, smoke as well as deploying the Zloy's gas. It looks like everyone's using a Zloy operator here. As you see, uh, Sophie at the top getting a kill on Danny Luke. Oh, and now uh, Brigante using the shotgun. Also, uh, I believe it's a Zloy operator with the RPG. Score is 16-14, 22-14, 2 minutes 46 seconds to go, Zulu for Italy, picks up a bag, looking to get back now to the Italian spawn, using that Zloy operator, throwing that smoke grenades out in the cover, doing a roly-poly, and applying more smoke, getting back into the spawn, unchallenged. Following now, uh, Cruzo for Romania, using what looks like the Dutch operator, with that McCready skin. Also has frag grenades and adrenaline again chased down by Sophine and taken out. Sophine with that kill there using that shotgun. Got that taser and adrenaline as well. Good to probably go in on Gok there. Gok rolls. Another shot. Misses with a taser. Takes out. Turrican gets the kill on Gok. Turrican now with that rotor gun. Nervo getting a double kill on Dob Riggy and Danny Luke. Now you see Sylphine now charging in but runs into a mine. Oh god, god getting the kill there. Danny Luke now using that uh, Deanna drone, dropping those frag grenades into the Italian spawn. Oh, hits that light. Lucky. Now you got Zulu charging uh, to the halfway point of the map. Grenades dropping overhead. Score is 62-28. Oh, Dob Riggy gets a kill. Bag is free. Frag grenades drop nearby. Gok does a roll. Gets to it. Drops. Gas is deployed. Sophine gets a kill on Gok. One of the teammates takes out Cruzo. Dunley gets the bag. Needs to get back to the spawn though, but it's taken out by Nervu. Nervu then double teamed by Turk. Well, one of the Romanian players and Gok has the bag. Looking to get back now. Score is 78 40. 46 seconds to go. Gok placing down those mines. Score now passively creeping up since Romania are the bag holders at this stage. But Italy are pretty much double points ahead, more or less. It's 82 49. Turrican now comes charging in with that rotor gun. Gets a kill on Gok. Gets a kill on Danny Lee. And gets a kill on Cruzo there with a triple kill. Dobrigi charging in now as well. Dobrigi gets the kill then with that shotgun. Nervu taking out Or. Bag is free. Cruzo just misses it. Might be getting a bit of lag there, but the bag is free in the Romanian spawn. No one's picking it up. Losing that from the passive points there. War picks it up, so it must have been the designated bag carrier for the game as it comes to an end. Scorbian 96 61. So, scoreboards. Top for Italy, we have Nervo scoring 28 points, which means 14 kills, 4 deaths, and 2 assists. And for Romania, we have Dobrigi scoring 16 points, which means 8 kills, 7 deaths, and 1 assist. Here we go again, match two of a possible five on the airplane graveyard. I see this map often. As we're following Turrican for Italy, Italy are the blue team. Sophine taken out by Dobrigi. Dobrigi using that uh, 
Dutch operator with that uh, SMG gets the double kill. It takes out Briganti as well. Got low health though. The bag now is slowly going to respawn. Oh, never gets the double kill with that frag grenade. As you hear those jet turbines start destroying the center objects in the middle of the map. And he got ore going in for the bag, but it's taken out by Italy. So Bean. Zula retrieves the bag, scores 14 points. The fourth. See Danilik. Oh, gets onto a mine. Dabriki there. Left alone there on his own in the spawn area. Nervu again the kill with a rotor gun. See Doc there also charging in. Briganti gets the kill with that RPG. Good shot. Oh, look at that. The drones actually collided to each other. <laughs> nice. Zulu, though, has the bag for Italy. On top of the broken up plane. Taking the high ground. Letting the Romanian players come towards them. Let's follow it now from uh, a Romanian perspective. As we follow Orr. With that... Uh, like... Uh, name? Weird name. Can't pronounce it. Got now creeping in has that uh, cookie skin for the Moses operator. I can't remember. I think it was cookie something. <laughs> He's available uh, of the in the Christmas 2020 uh, deal. Jumps in the v Jeep. Look at a charge in now and a little bit of a kamikaze. Ooh, bag is free. Guess the kill on Briganti. Mine drop. Grenades dropping by. Ah. And the usual thing, you get out of the car and right into a door. It would be nice if the developers added the option again out of the passenger door for once, because it's a nightmare when that happens all the time. See Danny Lick now going in on Zulu. Does a roll, hits the vehicle, and dies from the impact there. <laughs> but still classed as a car kill by Zulu. Following now Turrican though with the back, charging around the area looking for uh, those passive points. Let's go back to the Romanian side of things. See uh, Sophie getting a kill on Cruzo. Or under attack now is Sophie. Sophie gets the kill. Following Gok now on his own. Nervu comes charging in with that roto gun. Steps in a mine. Oh, that's Briganti actually got stepped in a mine. And Gok gets the kill on Nervu. Score 75, 28, 55 seconds to go. See Briganti there using that Chiron. Cloaked up. See those mines being placed down as well. Decloaks with that rotor gun. Takes out uh, Ore. See Gok as well placing down more mines. Sophie's on the other side of the container. Turrican getting a kill. Nervu Zulu holding the bag at the top though of the map. Nervu charging in on Dobriggy, getting the kill with that roto gun. Diana combo gets tasered and taken out there. Sneaky little play. Briganti. Low health though. Uses that sheer on the cloak. You see uh, some players in the area though. Decloaks goes in on Cruzo. And that is it. End of the match. 100 points to 34. So, top four. Italy, we have Sophine scoring 34 points, which means 17 kills, four deaths, and one assist. Whilst for Romania, we have Gok scoring eight points, which means four kills, nine deaths, and one assist. Let's quickly cycle through the gear. We have Zulu's level 11 out of 12, Dutch with the Maximus MG, Mark 6 weapon. 15 out of 15, 1 blue mod, 2 orange mods, level 15 out of 15 katana, level 16 out of 20 frag grenade, and 18 out of 18 on the adrenaline. So fiend with that level 11 out of 12, Joe operator with the cat called this skin, using that MG Polovac skin, power system animated skin too, 1 gold mod, 1 orange, and 1 blue, level 15 out of 15 katana, level 19 out of 20 laymore, and 18 out of 18 on the adrenaline. Then we have ore. Using that gingerbread. <laughs> I was almost there with a cookie remark earlier. Uh, level 4 out of 12 with a level 6 rotor gun, the uh, traditional skin for it. Uh, two purple mods and one orange mod. Then a level 10 out of 15 tomahawk. Level 12 out of 18 
Adrenaline and 9 out of 15 Lando Amida. Here we go, match 3 of 3 on the area map. Italy versus Romania, missed the first few seconds once again. Scores currently 14 out of 14 as you encounter more lag. Game reconnects as you see Orr charging in. Onto Briganti. Uh, gun hover in there. <laughs> so Sophie now going in on Orr. Using that uh, Moses operator. Looking to reload, but he's activated the second life. Shots from a prototype from above. I think Nervu uses the prototype. Ooh, more lag. Game reconnects. And. Sophine has the bag for Italy. Drones flying overhead. Switching now to Romania. We have Guck with a grenade launcher ready. Fires up on top of the platform. Connects and gets a kill on Zulu. Sophine now looking to charge in on four. Gets a few shots but pulls back. Four now. Second life activated. Taken out. Danny Lick. Rose taken out by Briganti. Oof. Briganti now taken out there by Cruzo. Sofino has the bag still for Italy. Charging in. Nuru getting the kill. Nuru taken out by Dalbriggy. Dalbriggy now charging in. Gonna go in on Sofine. Rose teams up with Gok. Doesn't nobody collects the bag as Gok is taking that Cruzo goes in, but it gets taken out again. Bag is still free. Such a now for the Italian players. That Diana drone highlighting the Sheeran down below. Flying overhead. Bag has been retrieved by Sophine of the Italian side. Sophine hanging around in the center elevator of the map. Gok now charging in as you see that prototype overhead, the Lando emitter kill from Sophie. As you see, Sophie's tasered but is still alive, and that is it. End of the match 100 points to 38. So, top for Italy, there we have 38 points. Sophie scoring seven kills, two deaths, and two assists. Whilst for Romania, we have Dobrigi scoring. 10 points, which means 5 kills, 8 deaths, and no assists. The game all. Here we go. Italy versus Romania on the old depot map. Romania are the blue team. Italy are the orange team. As you see, Sophine going in for the bag. Taken out in that uh, airstrike move there as Cruzo gets taken out now Orr goes in gets taken out again relentless attack there Nuru's uh, drone flying skills getting those kills with those grenades drops in flying around highlighting the opponents back though he's in the Italian hands Briganti holding it using the Dutch operator with that MG vehicle comes in Two Romanians on it. You see Zulu connect on Orr with that prototype. Dobrigi is being tasered and taken out there by Sophine. Now you have Danny Lick now hiding in the wall, trying to avoid those uh, grenades. Oh, sets off another mine. Takes out. Ganti has the back readily and challenged the map. Prototype now. Dobrigi avoiding that laser. It was Nervu that uses it, or Zulu actually. See <laughs> the viewpoint there. As Thomas now comes in, now's the time for Dobriggy to charge, but uh, needs a roll or something. Oh, straight onto a mine. Unlucky. Zulu though, keeping an eye on things there with that prototype. The one shot, one kill weapon. If it connects right, just misses Danny Look there. Danny Look now uses that RPG. Oh, the air defense. Takes out that RTFM and Zulu gets the kill there with that prototype. Nervu now charging in. Oh, Tase it as Thomas slowly comes, but Zulu gets the kill on Orr there. Now following Danny, look, using that Diana, dropping those frag grenades in. 
gets taken out there by the air defense. Got the Briggy now reloading that grenade launcher of his. Looking to charge in on the Italian side, but launches a Diana drone instead. Oh, crashes it. Straight away, unlucky there. As a frag grenade drops nearby. Launches now again. Oh, taken out by Nubu. <laughs> Nubu relentless there with that uh, Diana drone. Good flying. Thomas comes in across the map, or charges through, gets taken out by Turrican. Turrican using the Dutch, no, snake operator with the sniper rifle. Rolls as you see, down look behind, down look, oh, taken out by Turrican with a sniper rifle at close range. Cruzo getting a kill on Nervo. Oh, and now Dubriggy now. Drop some mine. Near Zulu. Zulu can't really move because I think the mine, whoever it's glitched to, hasn't activated. Oh, look at that. Tiny look there. Flips that car. But uh, here we go again. And that prototype goes in. Gets a kill on Dobriggy. Don't look now stuck. Rolls. Charges in. A little bit of a standoff. Daniel comes around the corner, charges in, and gets the kill on Zulu, but Brigante's there and finishes off the book. That is pretty much it. End of the match. Score is 100 points to 24. So, top for Italy, we have Brigante scoring 36 points, which means two kills, no deaths, and two assists. For Romania, we have Danny Look. Scoring 6 points, which means 3 kills, 6 deaths, and no assists. Good game all. Here we go. Italy versus Romania. On the skyscraper map, Italy are the orange team, Romania are the blue team. Bag door has been opened to the office room. As you see, Turrican second life activated with that Moses operator. Bag though, still free in the room. Retrieved by Italy uh, for Romanian. There, just for a second there, but gets taken out. Trying to see who's in the position to try and get that bag. Nervu picks it up for Italy. Looking to get back. Oh, steps on that mine by uh, Dobriggy. But Zulu comes from behind, retrieves the bag, and gets taken out by Zero. But then Zero is taken out then by Sopim. Turrican's second life comes to an end. But uh, for Italy, Sopim has the bag. See Danilek now taken out by Briganti. Briganti under attack, taken out by Gok. Gok placing down those mines, waiting for Harold to stop his barrage of gunfire. Now Romania look to push in onto the Italians as they place down the mines as they go. Oh, oh, oh. The mines setting off a little bit of a chain reaction there. Very unlucky. Now following Dobrigi and Turrican going at it in a little one to one action. Turrican with that MG has the range and the firepower, gets the kill. Gok and Cruiser now charging in on this right hand side. Gok and Cruiser gets taken out by that mine. Cruiser charges in, retrieves the bag for the Romanian side. Looking to get back to the spawn area as quick as possible. Score is 48 27. 2 minutes 5 seconds to go. Cruiser using that Dutch operator with that SMG, frag grenade, and adrenaline. Let's check it out now from the Italian side. Ooh! Bag is taken out. We've got uh, Sophie now looking to push in on this side. See him placing down those mines as the Romanian players slowly spawn. Here we go. Danny Luck steps on a mine of Sophie. Sophie's mine taken out there. Taking out the Italian player. Taking him out himself, sorry. Now you got Turrican charging in with that Moses operator. Looks like he's been affected by this law smoke. And it's taken out. Now the Romanians have all switched to Zloy's at the minute. 
might prove a little bit difficult for the Italians if they haven't got any Lando emitters. Switching out to the Italian side, see so if you get from that perspective as they look to push in. Zulu drops down with that touch of the MG. Looking to charge in, also got Briganti to the side, thrown in the frag grenades. Ooh, Danny look getting a team kill on Dobriggy there. Score is 66.50, just under a minute to go. Smoke and more smoke being thrown in the Romanian spawn area. Proving a little bit difficult for the Italians to get through, but they're using those grenades to clear out that smoke. Zulu has retrieved retrieved the bag for Italy at the minute. Holding off though in the office on the side of the map. They're alone, so looking to get back into the spawn area. As you see Dobriggy and Cruzo going in at the Zulu. Using that SMG Zulu taken out by Cruzo. Now Harold again with his barrage of gunfire across the map. See Sophine there on the other side. Looks like they're placing down mines. You also have Turrican there. Turrican getting a kill on Dobrugi. Turrican using that Dutch operator with the SMG, uh, with the MG, as you see Nervu taking out Cruzo. Turrican now in on Zulu, and that is it. End of the match. 98-64. So, let's go check the scoreboards. Top for Italy, we have Sophine scoring 37 points, which means 15 kills, 6 deaths, and 1 assist. Whilst for Romania, we have Cruzo scoring 18 points, which means 3 kills, 6 deaths, and 4 assists. Good game all.